History of Micronesia Micronesia, a region in the Western Pacific Ocean, consists of thousands of small islands scattered across the Micronesian archipelago. The history of Micronesia is diverse and spans thousands of years. Here is a detailed overview of the major events and periods in the history of Micronesia. 1. Prehistoric period at sea, 3000 BC, 1500 CE. Micronesia was settled by Austronesian-speaking peoples who migrated from Southeast Asia, bringing with them agricultural practices, pottery-making skills, and advanced seafaring abilities. The islands were inhabited by various indigenous cultures, including the Chamorro in the Mariana Islands, the Yapis in Yap, and the Pompeians in Pohnpei. These early societies developed complex social structures and engaged in trade and cultural exchanges with neighboring islands. 2. Spanish Colonial Period, 1521-1899 In the 16th century, Spanish explorers, led by Ferdinand Magellan, arrived in Micronesia, claiming the islands for Spain. The Spanish established a series of missions and forts across the region, but their influence remained limited to a few islands such as Guam, Palau, and the Northern Mariana Islands. Spanish colonization brought Christianity to Micronesia, with many native populations converting to Catholicism. 3. German and Japanese colonization, 1899-1945 after the Spanish-American War in 1898, Spain sold its Micronesian possessions to Germany. Germany established a colonial administration, known as German New Guinea, which focused on economic exploitation, particularly through copper production and phosphate mining. During World War I, Japan occupied the islands, leading to the League of Nations granting Japan a mandate over Micronesia in 1920. Under Japanese rule, Micronesia experienced rapid industrialization and militarization, with the construction of airfields and naval bases. 4. Post-World War II Era, 1945-1979 At the end of World War II, the United States gained control over Micronesia as part of the Trust Territory of the Pacific Islands, administered by the United Nations. The U.S. government made significant investments in infrastructure, education, and healthcare but also conducted nuclear testing in the region. Micronesians began advocating for self-governance and independence, leading to the establishment of the Congress of Micronesia in 1965. 5. Independence and Political Changes, 1979-present in 1979, the Federated States of Micronesia FSM, gained independence from the United States, becoming a sovereign nation under a compact of free association. The Republic of Palau, the Republic of the Marshall Islands, and the Commonwealth of the Northern Mariana Islands also achieved similar status in subsequent years. Micronesia faced challenges related to economic development, climate change, and the preservation of cultural heritage. Today, Micronesia consists of several sovereign nations and territories, each with its own government and unique cultural traditions. This overview provides a broad understanding of the history of Micronesia. For more in-depth information, you may refer to historical books, academic articles, or consult local historians and experts. Thanks for watching. Please like and share this video. Also hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and let's embark on a journey of knowledge together.